41 Action News anchor Mike Maruzars is out there, and he found a dad from Cincinnati who has strong Royals roots. Interesting. <laughs> Well, hey, I have to tell you, like I told you on the phone earlier, the excitement is building. We are less than two hours away from the home run derby. The blimp is humming above no longer storm clouds, which is a popular sign here and a popular aspect of the evening's activities. I just talked to a man named Randy James, drove in with his wife from Lee Summit. He says that he is thrilled to be here in the All-Star City, but we talked to this family who didn't have to drive too far to root on their royals. In the middle of the all-star block party, decked out in Cincinnati red, we spotted blue. It's it's fabulous. I mean, I'm, I'm still kind of pinching myself. Uh, you know, the run to the World Series was spectacular last year. It's it's really cool to see uh, seven Royals elected to the all-star game. Uh, really looking forward to seeing the guys in the field uh, come Tuesday night. Mark Rubick was born in Kansas City. But then when he was a little boy, his family moved here to Cincinnati, where he's now raising his kids as Royals fans. Well, my class doesn't have that many uh, all-star players for their team since they're with the Reds. We're a dedicated fans, so it's not our fault we're dedicated. This is where they headed next. A short walk from the ballpark is the convention center, converted into a sea of baseball activities. Go, 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 go. And plenty of places to show off that royal blue, even if you live in Ohio. It's only once in a lifetime that there's not going to be seven Royals players in my city that often, so that's pretty awesome.